Hi everybody, it's Joe Crook from FinSuite with a new FinSuite Webflow hack. In this hack, we learn how to take the text input from a form field and put it into plain text on the page in real time. This is going to create a really unique, fun, cool, personalized experience when someone is filling out your web form. You can have some fun with this. We are actively using this on the FinSuite site and it is cool. Let's see how it works. We're in the live example and we see a text input on the page as well as this text that says, we'll insert the name here. And that's exactly what we're going to do. As we start typing here, this is going to update with the name that we enter. Of course, on your live site, you're not going to have this will insert the name here text. Inside designer, you just put a space and it will say, hey, blank. And as the person starts typing, we will write the name along with them. So here I'm gonna write Joe and it says, hey Joe, we're about to send you a really nice welcome note. It's a cool way to personalize the experience and encourage somebody to go and click submit. Of course, you can take this to the next level. On finsuite.com, we have this same functionality working with a couple more fields. We put in the person's email address, their name, what they're interested in, and we show them the email that we're about to send them. So as they're typing, they are previewing what they're going to see in their inbox. Really cool, personal, and unique way to connect with someone who is filling out a form on your site. We're in designer and we have our input field and our text here on the page. We're going to be giving each of them an ID so we can identify them with JavaScript and then let them communicate with each other. Here we have our hack form input. This is going to have an ID of hack 28 name input. Then we have our text here. This is a text block. It can also be a span, totally up to you. As long as this text has an ID of hack 28 name text. And with those two IDs, they're going to be able to communicate with each other. And as we update the text in the input, it's going to update the text here on the page. As we said in the live example, you don't have to have a full line of text in here. Obviously you're not going to launch with this will insert the name here text. So let's say I just go and add a space and there we go. We can go and push the site live like this and it will say, hey, and as the person starts typing, this text will start typing along with it. Let's break down this code line by line. Before the closing body tag, we're going to insert our script. On every input field keystroke, we are going to run a function that changes the text with the value of the input field. Let's break this down and see how it works. We are targeting the hack 28 name input, and that is the ID that we gave to the input field. And on key up, we're going to run a function. So on a change on the keystroke change, when there is an update in that input field, we are going to run this function. And we are going to target the hack 28 name text, which is the ID we gave to the plain text on the page. And we're going to update its text value with this value. What is this? This is referring to the global object here. This global hack 28 name input. This is inside of this. So this is referring to the hack 28 name input. And we're going to get the value of it. So that is how all these pieces go together. It is really that simple. And when you want to do multiple fields, just copy and paste this, change out the IDs, and you can create a really custom experience when someone's filling out your web form. 
Thank you so much for checking out this hack. Please clone the project. We have the entire hacks project available for clone. Start learning how these hacks work and use them on your live site. We're always releasing new hacks. So if you want to be updated, subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you want a super simple plain text email when we release a new hack, sign up at finsuite.com slash hacks dash updates. If you want to request a hack, we'll check it out and see if it's possible in Webflow. Go to finsuite.com slash hacks dash request. That's effing sweet.